the burn patients often develop infection okay the hint is the burn patients often develop infection and the sample was collected that particular burn patient sample was collected means such sort of a pus that has been collected and organism was found to be obligate arrow okay the organism is found to be what obligate arrow fine obligate arrow means which needs desperate oxygen and it is found to be oxidase positive and it is best cultured on this particular media that is the citrimide agar yes please what is the answer dr mridul have answered is pseudomonas dr bhavar have answered it c that is pseudomonas and kishore also have answered it c okay and answer is c only you all are perfectly correct okay this is the oxidase test okay and what is oxidase test within 10 minutes this particular disc or a paper changes color from white to blue and this should happen in how much time within 10 seconds okay this is the oxidase test and what about the other test that is the catalase test they can confuse you with this also the catalase test the catalase test you already know 3% h2o2 1 that is the catalase test and uh, pseudomonas is found to be catalase and oxidase both positive okay it is found to be catalase and oxidase both positive is it fine and there are sufficient hints in this question and this is the way the questions will be coming in the neat exam this time and in the future ones okay actually why because there is a principle that is termed as pareto principle and pareto principle says that 20% of the topics they come 80% of the times important will always remain important that will always come in every exam whether it is neat or next or anything that will come so this also applies up that these are important organisms they will be coming today also and tomorrow also they will come in some form or other and with that some form i have told you in which fashion they can come burn patients they can give you this and they can correlate with this oxidase test either they can correlate with the catalase test also they can give any of the hints like obligate arrow here and oxidase positive and the culture media itself is crying off that it is pseudomonas the answer is citrimide agar in that that is pseudomonas aeruginosa best grows on the citrimide agar and here also is the rationale that uh, citrimide is a disinfectant this particular pseudomonas loves to grow on the disinfectant so this is another question that which particular organisms loves to grow on the disinfectants it does not allow savlon and ditol also to settle it can grow in them also so pseudomonas is that sort of a bacteria which can grow up in savlon and ditol also if they are exposed up for a very long time fine then another very important question guys is anti pseudomonal drugs they should be on your tips 100% one question is there from there anti pseudomonal drugs and in that in short i like to tell you that vancomycin and ceftriaxone okay vancomycin and this particular drug ceftriaxone they are not anti pseudomonal so this you need to know that they are not anti pseudomonal which one the vancomycin and ceftriaxone 